tonight. Let me make sure that the video stays sane. Um, it doesn't go in and out, in and out for you. Hold on one second. I hope you can hear me okay. Let me turn up the volume a little bit. Um, I don't know if that helped or not, but hopefully. Why isn't this? There it is. So, so let's go in here and let's turn that off. Okay, so today is a craft with me. It's Wednesday, the third Wednesday of the month, which is a craft with me. And so today I was going to do a live, but I thought, meh, I'll probably do a live next week or the week after. So I have some, I had so many things to do today. I was um, hanging with my daughter and I will put a video in here right now so you can see what we were doing. I was creating some napkins out of this fabric, this fabric and this fabric. Just some little napkins for our house for everyday use so that we're not using up so many um, paper towels. So. And she is, as as we speak, still painting some uh, canvas um, tennis shoes. So that's what we were doing. And I, it's been a crazy day. I've been doing other things. But I thought, well, I don't want to go live because then I know I'll st stay on here too long. And I have other things to do. But I wanted to get a Craft With Me video out for you today. And as, so I decided I was going to make a journal to this one that I just made myself now this is my own this is a personal daily journal that I have and I went ahead and I used this little boy and I put crowns on both of them remember this one I cut this out of the birds in bloom um, I put them on this journal for for myself I painted it white and I added some um, just some book pages and then I also added some of this fabric to some of the um, you know uh, paper edges because this um, this fabric is wonderful. When you wash it, it shreds. Let me show you. Look at that. It's just, just so, just so fluffy and fun. So anyway, so this is my personal journal, so I won't be sharing that with you, but I do have a daily journal that I do. <laughs> and, um, 
So I'm going to go ahead and create something like this. And the reason I'm going to do it is I'm going to give this away, or the one that I'm creating, this away at the end of the month. So we're going to transform this ugly into this beauty. Okay, so let's just get going. Let's get, get started with that. So the first thing we're going to do is just put down some... Um, um, basically some uh what do you call it just some this <laughs> my goodness I, I have to have a sip hold on i was being distracted so for this though i am going to go ahead and use the mod podge today so let me do that. I wonder if my daughter has my my daughter has my jar. <clears throat> so I might have to go and get another jar of water. Um, so let me do that. I won't disturb her. I'll just get my own. So hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't think I was videoing. I am so sorry. So I do that all the time. Basically, all we have done so far is just put a bunch of... Um, paper and I used uh, just a, a old book that I had so you didn't miss much I just basically laid a bunch of paper out and I talked to you a little bit so I'm really sorry that that was um but after I have a glass of wine I look at the thing and I can't tell if it's video or you're not and I forget so oh well <laughs> sorry all right but right now this is kind of larger than the last one my the book that I already made so I'm going to just cut it a little bit oh gosh I don't know what you've heard and I'm not going to go back in my video and look because I'm lazy that way but I am going to do that but I'm sure I have plenty of time to chat you up still so oh, I, what I did say was I'm very I'm very um stingy with this book because I got this book and I love this book and the papers are so thick and just wonderful and I only use it for really special things so yeah that happens and so I am using it for this so and I'm using three pieces of it so this will go um, fairly quickly today our little video I'm sorry it's going to go so fast but I'm not going to put it in fast mode anyway I am going to hang out with you Oh, this one feels really awful. Look at, let's see. It's okay. It's a little sticky. No, not using that one. I like, there's a certain feel to Jot. And if you don't, oh, this one feels like it might be the same way. Oh, no, that's better. Jot can be very um, goopy and gloppy and lovely. So that's one reason I love it. I really hate this kind of stuff because it's not. This is my favorite texture of, of glue. A lot of people are online going, oh, I wouldn't use, well, I actually haven't heard anybody say they wouldn't use Jot, but I don't see them using it like I do. <laughs> Maybe they're embarrassed. Maybe they think they have to use the good stuff. I don't know. I don't care. Not my problem. I use Jot and I'm proud of it. Okay, so then we're going to do that. Okay, so while that's drying, and it doesn't matter if it's a little dirty, that can, who cares? Look at that. We did get that nice and chewy, didn't we? Let's let that dry a little bit. That's okay. It's all grungy. So while that's doing that, let's go ahead and paint it with some gesso. And gesso. Let's use, this. I'm on an angle brush. I don't really think I have one. I think my daughter's borrowing it for her, for her project. She's in there still painting her shoes. Ah, that's okay. I'll use this one. Do I not have an ankle brush for this one? Oh, there's one. I just saw it. It's tiny though. Oh, that'll take forever, but let's see what we got. We don't need an ankle brush. We don't need no stinking ankle brush. We'll use what we got. There we go. Let's use this. It's big. We don't need no stinking angle brush. There we go. Now we can paint. Yay, paint. We're actually gessoing right now. We will go over this gesso with some paint. And uh, make it nice and white. 
Oh, that's a pretend to be Disney, right? Mm -hmm. When my daughter's done with her shoes, maybe I can have her bring them up here and show them to you. I'll probably have to stop because I want I need to show her where the um where the uh sealer is. Might have to do that for her out in the garage so we don't get it all over the place, you know what I mean? Yeah. Ooh, I hear her. Yes, I'm really bummed that the Dollar Tree might not have, I don't know if you heard me or not, because I think that the thing was not on, but um, the video. But the Dollar Tree doesn't seem to have these cardboard composition notebooks, The one, at least mine. They had these, like, plastic ones. I was like, oh, no, I'm not using those. I like these paper ones. We all like these paper ones, right? So, yeah, we're going to have to just, uh, yeah, deal with it. We're going to have to find these paper ones like well it's okay because they're only a couple dollars at um staples so what the heck right what the heck what the heck say Now, I should be having some plastic on here, but these are going to be, uh, hopefully, when you, whoever wins this is going to be using it as a fatty patty, so. So, hopefully, you don't care if it's not perfect, you guys. So, if you're interested, send in an ATC or a note or a little envelope of junk jar stuff or whatever is in your heart, but not nothing too big, guys. I really... I don't do well with great big packages because it takes me so long to open them and go through each piece that it, um, I just, I get overwhelmed. And then there's so much, so many things. Doesn't that sound, I know a lot of people love Happy Mail things and I love Happy Mail, but I just don't like a lot of Happy Mail. Um, yeah, so there's that. I don't mean to sound ungrateful. It's just that's a fact. I mean, you don't want to send me something that I'm not going to enjoy, right? So, yeah. All right. So now, since let's do that. Let's go ahead and add this to this. So, then we're going to have to put probably another, another, um, yeah, another, oopsie, did not mean to do that, dang it. Okay, I can fix it. I love this writing there. This one's so cool. I love it. I'm going to put some more. Um, what was I saying? I don't know. I'm into it. As you can see, I've got my candle. I've got my red wine. My daughter's arting. Life is good. Life is good, you guys. I love it when she's home and arting and stuff with me. She's so creative. She doesn't really realize how creative she really is. You know? She really doesn't. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put another little bit of the gesso around this edge, and then we're going to dry it and then put on some white paint, actual white paint. Yeah, see, even just with another coat of gesso, how nice that is, how much coverage you get. No, it's not perfect, but so, so what? Right? I need some of this gesso. I don't like that Liquitex gesso. I love, this is Liquitex gesso, but there's a professional one, and then, this is the one I really like. But I don't use it a lot, but I think I'm going to start. Okay.
And tomorrow I've got to get busy on my, my, uh, which one call it? My journals, you guys. Tomorrow's my journal day. But I've been walking and I started yoga-ing because I really felt like I needed yoga. How are you doing, honey? Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Excuse me. Good. Oh, goodness. Corona. Not funny. Sorry. Sorry, not funny. Okay, so there's that. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna let this dry a little bit. Oh, no, no, I don't like to do the back. So this, I don't know what I'm gonna do about that, except for probably nothing. You can just cover it with something when you get the book. That's your choice. Let's go ahead and blow dry this a little bit and I'll drink some wine and blow my nose all that. Dries fast. Okay, we are back. I am going to now use some white paint. It's not completely dry, but push off. Who cares? Let's do this. Use up some paint. Use up some paint, even if there's jessel on it. Boy, I'm just not a very careful person, huh? But we don't care. This is how we do. This is just how we do. You can really see how much better that does cover, though. I don't know if you can hear Gracie. She's over there with her little her water. She's always drinking water in here. Ever since I moved her water away from her um, food, she eats. So, she will drink so much better. Who would have ever known that this was a black um, book? Nope. Can't tell. Okay, so there's that one, that one. Which one did I use? Did I have, didn't I have another one? I thought I did, but I guess I'll just go ahead and try to use this one. I think it's kind of full though. Here, let me, let's use this one. It's smaller and, yeah. I'll be here all night with this brush boy. Patience is not my middle name. And if, if I have to put another coat on it before it goes out the door, I will. I don't have no problem with that, but I just want to get something in the video for you tonight, my friends. <sighs> Do 
Now there's more to making a fatty patty than just this, but I am just concentrating on the cover and, you know, a few little things here and there, but you, you know, you need to um, tape the middle part and, you know, do a little bit of um, securing of the pages before you start gluing, but I don't glue two pages together. Um, people have asked me, do you glue, and I, do you glue pages together? No, I don't. I, I, I don't because, well, if you've seen my video, my Fatty Patty videos, there's a lot of glue and stuff goes on each page. And so it kind of tends to um, just get really strong by the nature of the, um, the pages that we create. So, yeah, so don't worry about gluing them together. Um, yeah, but you do want to tape the center. I always kind of like tape the center and tape a couple of, and then tie some strings and stuff. And I might do that before this one goes out for you. Um, and if I do, you will see that on the giveaway video. I'll show you the, how this ends up looking completely ready to go for the giveaway. But for today, I just want to show you how we're preparing the cover and a few other little touches. Because I fell in love. I honestly just seriously fell in love with this journal the minute I made it. I was like, oh my God. I And I can't wait every day to get up and come in here and write in it when I'm, you know, when up with my coffee and yeah. So I don't daily journal all the time. And I, and like, I'm not going to lie and say, oh, I do that forever. And like, it's, you know, part of my life. It's really not. Um, but I do it until I don't want to anymore and then I move on and then I pick it up and I do it again. So yeah, so there's that. So let's go ahead and dry this. Doesn't that look good though? It's so pretty. It's so white. I mean, yeah, we can go over that with, do you think I should? Maybe I will. Maybe I'll go over this with a little, that white paint. Let's use up that white paint and go over the back. I didn't do that on mine, but we'll do that on this one. Now I'll kind of work that out too. So I mean, just yeah, yeah, this yeah. Why not? Just to add some more texture to it, you know. Okay. Oh, I love it. Add a little bit of gesso here. See, I'm not wasting anything, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how I roll. Okay. Yeah, I kind of like that. Oops. Oh, that was splattery, wasn't it? So I kind of feel like I should do this on mine. Maybe I will. I probably will. Not in a second, but I probably will at some point. Yeah, I like that. And I don't mind those grungy things that were that are coming off there. That's not awful. It's not terrible. Oh, I love it. All right, I'm glad I did that. That just kind of made it more white. So yeah, so you can do whatever you want with that. What a mess you got going on. Love it. All right, so we gotta let this dry before I can move on to the next steps. He go to hit it with a heat gun though. Ugh. Let this sit for a minute. I will be right back. Got a refill.
Hi guys, I am back. I had dinner with my daughter. Life is good. This is the front. This is too dark down here. I don't like that, but we can always put another this over that. I think we will. Because I don't like that dark. It does, does not look pretty there, right? That's not pretty. So let's paint this on there and then we'll go over that before it's before we send it out. Um, yeah, we had a salmon, um, salmon, I'm trying to yell now because I don't think you can hear me, a salmon, uh, salmon Caesar salad tonight, it was delish, delish, not gonna lie, it was lovely, okay, so that, that, that we'll just leave that there for now, and now, I, all I want to do is, on this one, I want to put one of these in there, one of my beautiful, pieces of book page that I don't like to use up. I'm going to put that right there because it's gorgeous. Put that there. And I'm so glad to get this video up tonight. I'm so sorry it was so late tonight, you guys, but today was one of those days. I, got, I had a lot, a lot going on and then Spending time with my daughter is, you know, she's not always going to be with me. You know, she's going to venture out on a life on her own. And so I try to take advantage of the time that she's here because I adore her and will miss her terribly when she leaves. Okay, so let's put that there. I'm going to go ahead and move that over. There we go. Cover that up. There we go. Let's we'll shift that down a little bit. And see, you can move it once it's on there if you're fast enough. Okay, so we'll put that there. There we go. Okay, so we'll put that there. That's fine. And then we'll do the same in the back. Put another page. Just grab something from the back. Mm-hmm. Gorgeous. I think that one's already taken care of back there, so that's fine. I actually think I want this one. There we go. Let's put this. I want the other side on there. I love preparing journals. There's something so satisfying about preparing a new journal for use. And especially this one that I'm going to give away because it's like, oh, I wonder where this is going to end up and how it's going to end up, you know? What kind of thought process is going to go in here? And I hope that this is cathartic and, um, you know, healing for anyone who who might get it. You know what I mean? That's, that's what I hope. I hope that this is everything that you need once you get it. I think that's about straight. That's about straight, isn't it? It looks straight enough to me. All right. So basically, we're just about there. Oh my gosh. How cute is this? It's going to be so, so cute. You're going to love it. All right. So what I'd like to do now is just add some of this. This is what I did to mine, and I love it. So I'm going to add it to yours as well. And I'm going to be quick about it. It's not a big deal. Don't You don't have to make a big deal about it, you guys. Just add some aliens here. So kind of like so. You could probably do that maybe a little bit. And get it off your finger. And then add it here like so. And I don't care... Look, it doesn't have to be straight. It does not have... I mean, it's a crooked cut. My cut was crooked. I don't care. We don't care, right? This is what we care about. And I'm going to pull it up a little bit because I don't like that part. There we go. So there's that. How cute! See how cute that is, you guys? Come on. Come on, I ask you. Is that not adorable? There we go. So now we're going to cut that. We don't need this anymore. We need this. Always need this and that. Wine and candles, chocolate, and James Taylor. 
There we go. And we're in heaven, right? Give me those three things, and that's all I need. All right, and then next, there's this. Let's cut this off. Okay. Kind of funky, wonky there. There we go. Love it. Isn't that cute? So, see, you are basically going to have a journal very similar to mine. So, I'm just going to kind of open up the book and find another part. And then I'm going to add this one to there, to the side. Okay, so we'll just add some aliens because that's all you need. A little bit of aliens. A little bit of aliens. And then we're going to put that there. Oh, okay, well, probably put a little bit too much aliens on that side there. So what we'll do is we will put some... Um, oh, that's perfect, though. We'll put some uh, wax paper. That's why we have an abundant amount of wax paper. And we'll just cut this right now. We'll trim it perfectly later. But right now, we're just going to put this here. Okay. What's going on with this? There we go. I bent it. My bad. Okay, so then we're going to put that right there like so. I mean, if you wanted to, and if you're really, like, anal, you could, like, double up this paper. Seriously, I don't care about that uh, crunchy, munchy right there. It's fine. <laughs> okay, so then let's go another little pinch in here. Like, it doesn't matter but since I put this one since I put this one on this side I'm going to put the next one on this side this is weird because this side is on here it this is just a, an otter an odd book this red page is usually over here and then there's usually no line over here so this is actually pretty cool and interesting so I'm just saying, okay, so I'm going to use this other piece, which I love. This is some other napkins that I made. Oh my God. I had so much fun making these napkins. I, once I learned how to do it, <laughs> it was fun. But getting to where I was mitered, before I mitered the sides, I was like, oh my gosh, this is horrible. Finally, I ended up mitering the sides and I did it right and I was all happy. I was a happy camper. So, yeah. So I'm just going to go like so for now and then pick it up and see what we got going on over here. And it's perfect. And then we can always just add a little bit more glue here. Somebody's calling me. It's a spam risk. I think they can just F-O. Okay, so then we're going to do this. A little bit more glue. Okay. I just love these pages when they have a little bit of something, something. Okay. Just adds so much to these books. Okay, then the next one, we're going to do it on the other side. Over here. And then we're going to put our little crowned birdie on the front and fix that um, part on the bottom there that needed some. I didn't like where that dark piece was. <clears throat> so, yeah. So, this fabric was some fabric that I bought and then I used it for some napkins. And once I washed it, it frayed. And I was like, ooh, that's cool. I'm not throwing that away. You know me, I'm using that. So this is what I used it for and I love it. Okay, wait a minute. So hold on guys, hold the phone. Okay, so did I put one? Yes, so now I need to put one here. If you're gonna do this at home, always use your wax paper. You can use your wax paper more than once guys, okay? You don't have to um, throw it away. I always use it. You can see that this has been used. And then I, I, I let it dry, and then I can use it again. So try to do that. That is a good thing. Okay, so I'm going to go like so. 
And again, I don't care about that. I think it looks cute. And then we're going to go back. What I'm going to do with this last piece is I'm going to put it on the edge here. Because that's fun. So let's put one right here. I think I need to put one on the very front too. But I'm not sure. So I have to look. But I think that's what I did on mine. I think so. Okay, so. My goodness isn't very... There we go. I think I'm going to need, okay, that's perfect on that side. I think I'm going to need to add some more here, though, because it's, you know. Oopsie. Whoopsie. Get over there. Okay. Make sure that's fine. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh. Scooped up a little bit here. Yeah, the glue will come through the fabric here if you don't, if you use a lot, like I did. I used a lot, so yeah, that that will happen. Okay, and this one's got. I I was really manhandling that just now, but I don't care. It's fine. It's perfect. And of course, at the end of this, I will make sure everything is not perfect, but perfect enough for us. So we're going to go ahead and use that one that we used earlier because it's dry. Not going to hurt anything. So let's put those, that there. And then I think I need one. Oh, no, I already did right here. Okay, good. Okay, so there's that. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Where's my, where's my um thing? Did you guys see what I did with my bird? Bird, bird. Okay, well now I don't know what I did with my bird. Oh, here it is. Here she is. So cute. I'm gonna stick that bird right there. Oh my god, it's so cute. See, this is one of the birds I put crown on. I love it. It's got a little flower. I might embellish and put a different flower here, like over the top. I don't know. But for now, we're going to go ahead and put this down. Let's use this. Shall we? Let's see. Oh, it doesn't feel too bad. Okay. That's kind of goopy. Maybe it's new. This isn't awful. I'm not hating this. I don't know why I'm not hating it. Usually I hate it. My goodness. I can tell what you're doing. Okay. Don't wreck my page, you. Okay, there's that. I'm going to rip this. I don't want to be. There we go. <laughs> well, there you go. I ripped it. I think it actually looks better now. All right, so let's just leave that there. Washable school glue. I don't know how this is going to hold you guys. I hope it holds like that. Actually, it's going to be fine because I am going to go over this with um, Gracie here. Want to say hi? Hi. Say hi, Gracie. Oh, she said hi, guys. Hi, guys. How you doing? Mm -hmm. I love you. Get your hair all over me. Get your hair all over me. So you want to do this. This isn't a good one because it's actually got glue on it. You want to use one that's nice and smooth so that it doesn't cause... Yeah, that's better. Mm. I love it. Sorry, here, let me go. There we go. There we go. I'm sorry about that. I was busy. But basically what I did was I just did this. I would love to put a saying on here. Um, so I might do that if you'll let me. Uh, I just might do that even if you won't let me because it is a gift. Oops. Yeah, there we go. Hi, Gigi. Hi, honey. Hi. 
There we go. good there now. I'm the most carefulest person in the world. Looking good. Looking really good, you guys. Okay. So, get some paint off of him. Okay. So, um, make sure there's no paint. Okay. Good. So let's hit this with a heat gun. Lauren, why don't you come in here and show me your... Oh, that's mine. Oh, I gotta go. I'll be right back. Okay, so we are back. I am going to go around this with a black pencil. I don't really have a good one. I need to buy one. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Uh, where's my... Oh, I have this one. We can use this. So let's go ahead and go around it with this. Oops, we're on. Gracie's still here. Lauren is almost finished with her um with her tennis shoes, and I hope she'll share those with us. Lauren, are you gonna show your tennis shoes? Okay, yeah, show us now. Here she comes. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. She said they don't have the laces in them yet, but let's take a look. Oh my gosh. Okay, so first off, we'll, we'll let her do it. They started out white canvas, you guys, and they got really funky and dirty, and so she painted them. And them yellow. That's a really cute color. Oh my God, those are going to be fun, right? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, honey. So that's what we were working And you saw that, I think I remember telling you guys, I saw the video earlier of um, us working together and I was working on my napkins and she was working on her um her tennis shoes how fun crazy so yeah that's a lot of fun so I am excited to see her playing like that you guys I love that I love it I love working with my kid you know there's nothing nothing better than that <laughs> means a lot to me because like i said earlier i just don't know how long that's gonna last right <sighs> okay so where's that little this is my stuff i don't know what happened to my other one hi gregory so if you are interested in winning this little composition notebook um let me know and i'll be happy no, don't let me know. Just send me an ATC or a postcard or a little envelope with something in it. Not too much again. And you will be in the drawing. And that will happen on the first Wednesday. This one is going out on the first Wednesday of what month? March. So this is going to be the March um, March winning. Look at this. this I don't like There we go. Let's just... Grunging that sucker up a little bit, guys. I really like it more, a little bit more. Yeah, like so. Yes, more like so. Not fun. This guy's cute, right? I love it. This was my favorite. Then I have a little. I have a little squirrel. I wanted to do too. So he's in my stash so much fun I'll probably put a word some words on here you guys I probably can't I can't resist I, I actually really love this cover so I think I'm gonna want to finish it for you unless you tell me not I don't know it might I might not be able to help myself just saying sorry so and if you get it and you don't like what I put on there put your own thing on there but um, I really like this cover Some, yeah. Let's 
so funny tonight, you guys. I swear, it was so funny. I, I walked into the living room, kitchen, you know, the open, we have like an open kitchen area, living room thing. And I was like, what are you doing? She goes, I'm watching iCarly. And I'm like, oh my God. She hasn't watched iCarly since she was like 13, you guys. I was like, oh my God, I'm loving it right now. Isn't that funny? Just so funny. <sighs> I love it. So then there's that. So see, and the light is a little bright, but sorry about that. But I did get a new light and it's very bright. So yeah, there's that. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and just push those down. Let's just take a little quick look here. I think, I think that's it for the night. Um, so basically that's it. I mean, this is done. I mean, I mean, it's got the nice frill on the side and this one has the um, frill on it. I mean, that is going to be so much fun to play with. And when you get it, um, yeah, it should be a lot of fun. And then one more in the back. So there you go. So I am going to leave the wax paper in there and not take those out right now. So that's that. Um, so thank you so much for joining me tonight. I hope you enjoyed this craft with me video. This is what you can do if you want to turn a composition notebook into a fatty patty. Um, there's other steps to it, but I will do those in another video for you. And this is just going to be something that I'm going to give away. I don't know what words I'm going to put on here right now, or if I'm going to put a little flower right here. I, I'm tempted. I'm not sure. You know me. I never know until I do it. And that's the way I like to art. So anyway, thanks so much for hanging with me, you guys, tonight. I really appreciate it. And I will talk to you next week. If I don't see you sooner, I'll see you next Wednesday. All right, love you guys so much. Take care, be safe, you guys. Bye now, love you, be well.